hello friends today i'm going to show you how to fix sql server uh, access denied issues let's see so currently my sql server agent is in stop mode so when i click start so uh, see access denied error so it means what is the instant service account that we are having for sql server is unable to access the folder okay if you click show, show copy message and uh, go not bad and paste it see unable to start error so let's see what is the service agent account if you see here sql server is having i mean uh, user uh, to user okay uh, so now we'll go let's go to the properties see here just copy this and go to run and paste it and remove this sql agent log press ok run the uh, sql server agent that uh, internet service account is trying to access this file but uh, but there is no permission on this file okay so now go to the log for log here click on properties go to security now click lenovo for lenovo we are having users sql server agent see i don't have any uh, I mean full permissions real and execute will be there uh, but I don't have any full control and for SQL Server I am having so for this reason uh, so now SQL Server agent I am going to give full permission mm, okay so now first of all our user is this one right user 02 click check one click ok now click apply okay click apply now now go back yeah user a2 is having sufficient permissions even though you click error just execute that click ok ok now refresh it uh, click log properties security now see that agent is having full permission and sql server a agent 2 is also having sufficient permissions now uh, it is not required actually uh, as of now this is okay but i will re recommend you new login let's see that uh, other it is resolved uh, otherwise i would like to add user 2 in this uh, login and also I mean give the sysadmin permissions but let's see whether it is going to restart or not okay uh, start click yes still I am getting an issue now now let's go and add that new login Yeah, now user 2 is uh, insufficient permissions. Click refresh. Still, I'm getting access denied error. Uh, go to log. Go to properties. Full permission, full permission. Now go to log. So now go to that error uh, log. SP underscore read error log. Need no error. So I'm not getting any error, okay? So now what if we will do? Open any one notepad here. 
see that age what error is okay So this is also one reason. So now it's running. Just connect to the SQL Server, refresh, and start. What the error? So let's let's start the SQL Server. Yeah, now it's running. Okay, so. Now go to refresh it. Okay, so since like troubleshooting will involve like various things, and okay, sometimes we need to start from severe. Okay, so what I have done uh, is uh, I have given sufficient permissions on log for uh, the log file, uh, and I have given added that for. Um, instant service account to the folder and I have restarted the SQL server and manually started from using services.msc. Uh, I think uh, you have seen the live troubleshooting and thanks you may like this video. Thank you. Bye.